Hi everyone, just a simple one for today. Uh, I have here a triple five timer and an internal MOSFET plus an uh, ignition coil which I uh, have been painted because it's, it looked like crap. But um, the problem with this uh, circuit is that uh, the MOSFETs die very fast because of the back EMF which is about a few hundred volts and that uh, kills the MOSFETs and sometimes the triple five timer so I've got an uh, about 12 volt power supply for the triple five timer and uh, well I should say battery and uh, a 12 volt battery for the ignition coil part. I uh, tried using an um, LCD filter which consists of a capacitor, diode and uh, a resistor but that, that uh, makes the output voltage of the coil very low so uh, not really worth it. And the problem is, is that uh, the working voltage for this uh, setup is about 13 to 14 volts before the MOSFET, the, the MOSFET dies, so uh, pretty useless thing because uh, this uh, coil weight is pretty high and uh, the it runs on a very annoying frequency and uh, compare that to a flyback transformer this thing is very not so fun for the high voltage enthusiasts but uh, I'm gonna show you the output voltage Right there you can see a jet of plasma going into the this cup and uh, let's change the frequency Look how tiny this arc is. Sorry. Not very useful. So it best it it runs best on the low frequency. Anyway, so uh, let's tear it down and see what's uh, inside on a coil like this. I wanted one for uh, uh, about two years, and when I got it, I got pretty disappointed with the output. I expected something more. And there inside is a screw, and I'm gonna get uh, the screw out and empty the oil which is inside here, and uh, try to get uh, this cover up. Of so, wish me luck with that. <laughs>
Okay, so uh, I've managed to take it apart in a pretty bad way, unfortunately, because uh, I couldn't get that uh, cover off and uh, I had to smash it, fortunately. But uh, here you can see inside is some sort of uh, paper and some residual oil and plastic. Uh, this is the oil that I got out of it, out of it, without uh, spilling the rest. And uh, I found this piece of plastic inside. I really have no idea what. Uh, this is sounds like a crescent plastic. Uh, okay, so here is the main part. As you can see, the uh, oil. This is the primary, and that's the core inside. Um, and that's actually the secondary which is uh, tied to the negative side and the core has a wire you should see it yes, there is it so uh, as you can see this is a metal core, not a ferrite core oops, I dropped it it's very slippery alright so oops. that's uh, the metal parts a lot of them. Okay, um, let's uh, take this paper off and see how many layers of wires the secondary has. There you can see a lot of layers of wire. If you think about it, it has more secondary wire than a flyback transformer mm. there is some sort of a PVC pipe mm. pretty nice though but my advice is uh, don't try this at home it's a very dirty job thank you for watching